in the village of the Barstow By the coop on a cloudy day Stood a chicken named Foxler Watching his life roll away the song currently playing isn't just any tune. It's one of the many tracks you can discover on Cluckin' Country Radio, the latest addition to our game. That's correct, folks. We've introduced radio to the game. This is just the beginning of several radio stations we plan to include, and Cluckin' Country Radio is still a work in progress. But fear not, because the host, Cletus Cluck, is here to entertain you. Let's raise a glass to all them hard-working folks out there and toast to the simple joys of life. Barn Stiller and Gale, smooth as can be. Sweeter than a honey, they set me free. Now, whether you're driving your Yugo, Kearong, or even a taxi, you'll be serenaded by the sounds of Cluckin' Country Radio. Occasionally, Cletus Cluck will chime in, and we've even thrown in some commercials for local businesses. All the songs are original creations, and we hold complete copyright over them, so feel free to use gameplay footage in your YouTube videos or streams. It was a no-brainer for us to kick off the radio feature with a country station. What do you think should be the next radio station we add to the game? Share your thoughts in the comments section. Rapidly moving on! We've revamped the inventory system with several new features. First of inventory categories in search. Now you can easily find your items with the addition of filters for various item types. Whether you're looking for ingredients, food, or equipment, simply select the appropriate category. Additionally, we've introduced a search function, allowing you to quickly locate specific items amidst your collection. Second big update to inventory and items in general is visual indicators for power-ups and effects. To provide clearer information about the items in your inventory, we've incorporated visual indicators. Now, when you hover over an item, you'll see icons representing any power-ups or effects it applies. These indicators are also displayed directly within the item description and in the corresponding item slots, making it easier to understand the benefits of each item at a glance. One smaller update to the inventory is convenient inventory access. We've streamlined the process of accessing your inventory. With the press of a button, the I key, you can now instantly open your inventory screen. We've implemented significant enhancements to the cooking system, ensuring a more satisfying culinary experience for players. Cooking meals with special effects is now a breeze. We've simplified the process, eliminating unnecessary complexities and making it much easier to whip up dishes that offer special benefits. We've meticulously balanced the meals produced through cooking, ensuring that each dish offers a fair and rewarding experience. Say goodbye to cluttered inventories. We've implemented a stacking feature for multiple meals of the same type. Now, identical meals will neatly stack within the inventory, freeing up valuable space and allowing for more efficient organization of culinary creations. But wait, there's more. We've introduced a change that many of you will appreciate. We've shortened the grass. This means that you can now spot cluck reactors, mushrooms, carrots, and everything else that can be found in the grass much more easily. Additionally, we've made adjustments to the color and shading to enhance the overall visual appeal. We're far from finished. We added an exciting new quest for you to enjoy, promising great rewards, but we won't spoil it. You'll have to play it yourself. Furthermore, there have been adjustments made to enemies and a few other elements. For the full rundown, check out our post on Steam. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and dive into Turbo Chicken Simulator. Stay tuned for the next development diary, Will. Until the next time, keep those feathers flying. Believe me, Daddy, it's not because of her.